Maybe the two biggest stars in Philly. Meek Mill, biggest rapper in Philly. Maybe the biggest rapper in Philly since Will Smith. What do you say, Babcock? Mm, yeah, hey, just for the look, I don't like it. Uh, for the look, I don't like it. We're talking about, you know, Lil Willie's play for yeah, play right yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, shout out to Benny Siegel when I said that, though. Um, the Joel Embiid. Philly's new buddy superstar, a lot of people say it's just a matter of time before he becomes the best player in all of the NBA. He's killing it. Um, went to visit Meek Mill in prison a little earlier this week. Babcock, tell me what's going on. Yeah, this. this is absolutely awesome. We know Meek Mill earlier in the month was uh, sent back to prison for a minimum of two years. A lot of people have felt that that was unjust. There was a huge, huge uproar on social media from tons of celebrities and other people yeah, who that thought it was, that, that was, was too it, severe. A right, heavy-handed, all that stuff. So, Joel Embiid, who had had forged a friendship with Meek over the years uh, that he spent in Philly, actually went with the co-owner, Michael Rubin, of the 76ers, and on Friday, they went and visited Meek in jail, and uh, from people I talked to said that Meek was very appreciative, that they both took the time to show up, and it really lifted his spirits, and I thought that was pretty awesome. That's actually. pretty awesome. You know, we know that these guys are friends, because I don't know if you guys remember. Uh, one of Joel Embiid's sort of most controversial moments is when he was dancing at a Meek Mill show just a little while after having a knee injury. Check out this video right here. <laughs> right, some Philly up. fans were a little PO'd about that. Like, some Philly how can fans he dance were... but not play? Well, he, well, now he's doing nothing but playing, man. Yeah. He's killing the league right now. You yeah, see him right there. 23 points a game. Uh, with, oh, look how short Meek looks. Meek is, oh, by the <laughs> way, Meek is a, a decently tall guy. Right, he's like he's not one. short. He's standing yeah. next to those guys. Right. Like it's a, just that Embiid is seven feet tall. Um, uh, By the way, not the only celebrity that has visited Meek Mill. We have Who Al else? Sharpton, Jay-Z, T.I. Didn't a lot Colin of Kaepernick have. also call him? Colin Kaepernick Kaepernick called and talked to him. So he's getting a lot of love from the world of hip-hop and the love of sports. Here's my thing. Yeah. Let's say you're someone living in Philadelphia, living in Pennsylvania, mm -hmm. and you don't really think what happened to Meek Mill is unjust. Does seeing one of your favorite athletes from your state, from your city, go there to visit him change your mind about that at all? No, mind your own business. Joel Embiid is friends with Meek Mill, and he's sticking up for his buddy, and he's trying to help his buddy who's in a tough position right now. So they should mind their own business, be happy with the points he's scoring for you. So you're not saying you're not saying free Meek Mill here. You think no, what I'm happened? Saying, with... No, I, I think it was it was unjust what happened to him. Oh, I, really? Yeah. What? Why are you surprised? Why are you surprised? Why are you, are you surprised? saying that you actually think that the system might have messed over an African American male yes, man type absolutely. person? Ab ab 100%. Wow. I want this just to be marked. Meek, if you get out, just don't kneel for the national anthem. <laughs> 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 it, it, was, it was very heavy-handed. Let him out. I'm glad that Joel Embiid visited him. It's Let a cool them all thing. out. You heard it right here. Babcock, <laughs> all the brothers, we're coming home. If you like what you just saw, videos, great stories, and crazy photos, we've got more like it every single night on TMZ Sports on FS1.